threats of potential harm increase with every step. Finding a viable source for water still remains top priority on the African lowveld. So this is where I would get really spooked, going around a bend like this, because you just can't see. Cody, I'm gonna cut around here, get to the outside, so I can see around the bend a little bit. Hey, Cody. What? Water, bingo. That's good. You know what that means, though, man, potentially. Big megafauna, so just go real slow. Let's just check it out. Lion, Cody. Two more, right there, behind the brush. Your first instinct is to want to run. The flight or fight is going to hit you really hard, and I feel it right now, but you can't do that. If you run from an animal with the instincts to kill like this thing, it's going to track you down, and it's got you. There's no running away from this animal. We are in flat, open ground. Keep an eye behind us, because these things hunt in prides. They could be anywhere. Joe and I are in a very arid area. Obviously, we need water. This is like the nightmare fulfilled. Water, big cats. Dang. At least they're not coming towards us. They're moving away. Let's sneak and get some water over yeah. here, and then get the hell out of here. Yep. Now, the cats seem to be moving away from us. What is that, to circle around and flank us? Dude, wherever there's three, there's more. Look at that thing. Hippo. Cody, we need to get out of here. I've been through the best training that our military can provide. Nature rules out here. Dual survival in all new season, Tuesday at 9 on Discovery.